Pearl Tutorial Part 86 Closures Now closures give us a way to initialize a subroutine with data before we use that subroutine. We can only use closures with lexical variables. A closure is an anonymous subroutine that has access to the lexical variables that were in its scope when the subroutine was compiled and we can keep those variables in scope when the subroutine is called later. Now let's create a subroutine called print it and we can say my string one And let's return an anonymous subroutine. And let's say my string two and print. string 1, string 2 so now let's call our subroutine which will initialize string 1 with the word Perl. So now our returned reference to the subroutine is stored in our reference variable. So now if we call our subroutine with our reference with a new string the subroutine will retain the first string and print out both strings so let's save this and let's run it and here we have Perl tutorial and let's try a couple of other words Perl tutorial, Perl script, Perl code. So that's how we use closures to initialize a subroutine with data before we use it.